Welcome to the channel. It's that time of day, guys. Well, not not yet. It is about 11:40, so about 12:30, 12:45. I'll be setting the camera up the stairs on the deck to film the eclipse. And after reading the instructions on the filter, turns out all I really needed to do was cut a small piece off and tape it directly to the lens. So hopefully that works. And uh, I'm going to be up there, but I'm also going to be down here walking around because when you have an eclipse, it puts off some pretty cool shadows, especially if you have trees. Uh, I remember the last one in 2017, the fence had little half moons or half suns, half moons, whatever you want to call them in it. So hopefully we get to see something like that again today. So let's turn around here. Waldo, are you starting to act weird yet? He can't hear. I keep forgetting he can't hear. Well, he done ducked inside. And, uh, well, we've got these cirrus clouds in the sky. And I don't think we're gonna have any trouble viewing the eclipse. Those are cool, ain't they? Look at that one. Look like a dragon. Uh-huh. And, uh, we turn around here, guys. You'll see my garden is no more that's right i'm not gonna have a garden this year made that decision dumped all the dirt to fill in this area hopefully that helps with my flooding situation which i haven't had since putting in the french drains really but you know what let me tell you something it is very difficult gardening in arkansas and the hard work you put in compared to what you yield, to me, it isn't worth it. At least this year it's not. So maybe next year. But man, this, this video is not about gardening. It's about the eclipse. So let's get going. Do you often find yourself staring into the deep, dark night sky? The universe glistening planets glimmering do you wonder are we alone is there more out there who are we and where did we come from with this one inexpensive device you can transform your ceiling your walls into your own private galaxy. Lean back in your recliner. Put on some soft music. The stars will sparkle to the beat of each tune. The starry projection lamp will give you the feeling you are floating through outer space. The device is in laser and LED and the light direction is fully adjustable. Your children will learn to appreciate the galaxy. It will relax you. You will wonder why you have never ever used one of these devices before. Be sure to click on the link in the description below when you are done watching the video I will guarantee you you will be a hundred percent satisfied I guarantee it and that is the rest of the story all right guys if you're interested in this gadget here, this is the Starry Projection Light. It has laser and LED. It has many, many settings. You can have red color, green color. You see, you've seen the planet. Uh, it has laser. It'll even dance to music. Yeah, it even talks to you. And, uh, you know, I bet your kids would love something like this. Now, this is a cover off of the lens. It's kind of like an old disco ball. But it's projecting different colors and, you know, it's 
pretty relaxing and you have you can adjust the speed make it go faster you can make it go slower uh, I don't think I've found all the different settings yet because I I see this little dial here I never mess with that so we're gonna have to mess around with it and see what it does now this thing is about fifty nine dollars yeah that's all and you can set it up where it's sitting flat or it has a little leg there so you can have your own little solar uh, eclipse and stuff in your own bedroom aim that dude to the ceiling put on some you know I love music. I bet your woman would like it. Or your man. There you go. Got all that stuff it does. So, y'all check it out. I will leave a link in the description. It ain't gonna break the bank. And it's kind of cool. If you watch my podcast this morning on the Washtaw Mountain channel, I used it in the background. Pretty cool. kind of taking its time but you can see the non evergreen trees in the mountains there they're finally blooming and my oaks have not yet well, that one there is blooming a little bit so is that one of those aren't oaks uh, they're always the last oh am I hitting that sun I am don't want to do that So this is before the eclipse. Hey, I found my garden. Yeah. There it is. I'm gonna give all those to Peter. He wants them all. I'm not messing with it again. Nope. prepared but I'm not I was gonna put the drone up apparently when that drone sits in its case for a month or so the batteries go down so it only had and then I can't find the phone that has the program to run the drone so we're not gonna have the drone but uh let's go over and see if Waddles is acting a little strange I bet he don't Waddles, you don't be looking at the sun. You. He said, I ain't scared. You gonna give out a crow? It's Mr. Waddles, ladies and gentlemen. All the hens are in there. That's big pile of poop, Waddles. Oh, here comes another participant. Now, I have seen a lot of people driving down the highway going towards the campground, so, yeah, they're probably going to get some locals. I can't see too many out-of-staters coming here. We're kind of off the beaten path. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. We're going to save some of this film for later. Models, get your glasses out, buddy. Get your glasses out. He's starting to act a little edgy. I don't believe in all that mumbo jumbo. This rooster. Are you feeling any different? Nope, nothing, nothing, nothing rattles the rooster. Just sitting in your biscuit. Don't look at the sun. Well, you really can't because it's behind you. You're not gonna be able to. You lickopotamus.
Your breath stinks. I need to get you a doggy breath, man. Your heater's on. I'm sorry. It's hot in here, Lily. I had your heater on. That boy better not be out there looking at the sun. You know. Oh my God, it's 100 degrees in here. I could get the fan on for these guys. You know Chinese boxing? All right, let me look and see where we're at here. Oh, that is cool. But unfortunately, this is my setup. Hopefully it don't blow away. Uh, yeah, it don't look too good on my app. <laughs> Hopefully I can get it in the editor and it looks better. Man, you barely touch that stuff. You get a fingerprint, whatever on it. Uh, I didn't build the contraption I was planning to. It wouldn't have worked anyway. It has to be directly on the lens. So. It is a little cloudy out that way. Wow, look at them clouds, guys. Yeah, I don't see too many good uh, videos uh, that are live right now either. It's just something hard to capture with our cameras unless you got the professional equipment. Uh, we should start getting some pretty good shadows pretty soon. I don't know if the clouds are going to blow in and ruin it. I think they're blowing the opposite way, so we ought to be good. Well, you know what, guys, if they don't come out, I tried. Got one of the best seats in the house. the garden was and is no more that area needed some soil and it got it just ain't in me this year guys just ain't in me to grow a garden this year but uh let it be something else i don't know But I promise I'll visit some farmer's markets. I just suck at gardening. <laughs> I don't know, last few years, out of, out of the 10 years I've been here, I've gardened eight. Uh, you know, there's been some good years, mostly peppers. But tomatoes, you're lucky if you get one, maybe two crops, and they're not the greatest. Let's see, we got Tilly under the shed. There could be no better place for a dog right now than under the shed. Let's take note of where the shadows are. Oops, oops, we can't hit it. How are you guys behaving? Waddles is picking on you, ain't he? Waddles, be nice. He didn't do nothing to you. Waddles. You suck at flying. You leave her alone, that's why she gets up there, because she knows you fly like a big old pack of baloney. Yeah. You can outrun him, girl. He can outrun him. It's just the sun and the moon. Ooh. Ah. Oh. 
Ooh. Oh. Well, it's about halfway there. Getting a little darker. There's Tilly. Why don't you come over here with me, Tilly? I think I'm going to start wearing these all the time. Bigfoots. They're all making noise in the background. Do you hear them? <sighs> something, something to do with the eclipse. Birds, shut up. If I can hear Bigfoot. I can hear them in the distance. They're beat, beating on trees. Tilly. Tilly, can you hear Bigfoots? Looking through my glasses. About three quarters of the way there. Sorry if I'm jumpy. Ooh, do not expose. Gimbal protection, recenter. Let's try that again. Of course, I can only hold my hands in this position for so long. We'll wait till total totality. <sighs> Mr. Waldo. Are you feeling a little weird? It's getting darker. How do you feel, sir? I forgot to feed you guys today. It's time to go to bed. Are you hungry? He don't hear squat because he knows the word hungry. Why is it getting dark? It was a short day. I know, that happens when you get old. I know. Where's Lily? Alright, the winds are picking up a little bit. And more clouds are blowing in. But it is getting considerably darker. And it's about a little past three quarters of the way from the total... Totality. Not seeing any weird shadows yet. But we will. Wouldn't it be cool to see a snake? See about six shadows of it. Oh. It was far too cold this morning for snakes to be out. One of the weirdest things I've ever filmed. Woodpecker don't care. He's going to town. He's on that dead tree there. Of course, I've got my loyal Miss Tilly. She could care less. You want to wear my glasses? So you can look at the sun? No? You're not going to chew those up. Here. He says, I'm blind. It's fixing to get really dark. It's almost covered. The birds are going a little nuts. They're all gathering in that dead tree. Let's take a look at the sun. We place this in front of the lens very carefully. Oops. That's the woodpecker. Let me try to get this right. Camera's really picky. <sighs> oh man, 
Man, don't blow my camera off the balcony, please. Yeah, these birds are freaking out for sure. Ooh, what the heck kind of birds them are? Of course, as soon as I hit record, they shut up. All the chickens that went in the roost. Waddles, he never goes up in there. He's usually standing by the door. And it's getting a lot darker. There's some freaky shadows. I just heard the horses back behind me going nuts. We're about 95% till it's covered. Just about gone. Dogs down the road, which I don't ever hear much. They just started going nuts. Chickens aren't behaving. I don't know if any of that has anything to do with this. All right, it's really getting dark now. Let's take a peek. Let me get this covered up. Primitive. Where is that sun? Through the trees. Somebody's out working on something. Real dark, I would say. And the camera's probably making it brighter than it is. What is it, Waldo? Look at that. My street light just came on. It's a fake night, boy. It's a fake night. Don't you believe it for a minute? It's not really night. Waddles have been picking on that hen. All right, I think we're at total. Let me look. It feels like it's about 8.30 at night. It's really getting dark now. Just gonna let it roll for a bit, guys. We're almost there. Let me peek at it. Oh yeah, there's just a sliver. I got all these trees in my way. Oh wow, is it getting dark? Where are you at? Just a minute sliver. Wow, I ain't never seen it get this dark. Whoa, is this a trip. Wow, I gotta look at this. Man, this is wild. There is no more sun. We are 100% total. Insane. That is awesome, man. The crickets, the crickets are going. Wow, street lights are on. That is insane, man. It's like nighttime. I bet I could just peek up there now. Wow. 
Not even a hundred, a star. I'm seeing stars. Taking a chance by filming that. I hear coyotes. Tilly, what is going on? Man, is it dark. Even my flag lights on. What's going on? It's daylight. It's going to be daylight in a minute, Tilly. Come on. I don't think I've ever... I think the last full one was in 17, but it certainly did not get this dark. I need to put these glasses on. Look. I'm missing out the best part. I can't see nothing. that cool. I should be able to get that with the camera. The gimbal is not cooperating. Well, I guess that's it. There goes a butterfly. my stomach. Here comes the sun. It's all out there, okay? It's quickly getting light again. What do you think of that, boy? Look how quick it's getting light. Oh, it's so calm. That's probably the only eclipse you'll ever see in your life. Well, I know it will be, because you weren't here in 17. Well, they'll see one. You've never seen one. Where's Melly? Well, there's Lily. And sadly, it's probably the last one I'll ever see, or Waldo, or Lily. And you really can't see the damn things, because you got to wear these goofy glasses. And Waddles? Yeah, it's morning. Sun's coming up. Most confused rooster in the world. Oh, poor rooster's out on the porch. She's probably thinking I abandoned her and fell asleep. All right, let's 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 see what Rooster does. I'm going to act like I left her out all night. Did I leave you out all night again? Huh? You were out all night. I know. I'm bad. I'm a bad daddy. And just as quick as it started, it's gone. All right, guys. <laughs> the eclipse. I don't know if that camera upstairs did any good. I'll do the best I can in editing. Uh, if it, you know, if anything, I'll put it on a fast, fast time lapse. It is already recording on time lapse. Uh, it is what it is. Uh, my cameras aren't equipped for such events. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Happy trails.